Words. Here's an interesting one. Did you know that bookkeeper, bookkeeper, see in case you can't hear me because stuff is crazy out here. Bookkeeper is the only word with three consecutive pairs of letters. B O O K K E E P E R. It's really cool. I like words. Words are fun. There's, um, let's see, like, oh, Numana Ultra Microscopic Silicona Volcaniconiosis. I wonder if I can still spell that. P N E U M O N O U L T R A M I C R O S C O P I C S I L I C Silicone. C O N O V O L C A N. O S I O S? Fuck. Anaconiosis. Ah, fuck, I messed it up. I got it pretty damn fucking close. It's like the longest word in the English language, I think. Um, something having to do with like a black lung from breathing in volcanic ash and just, you know, generally having a bad time. Yeah, words are really cool. I, I've always been a really big fan of English. Um, the semicolon is like the best fucking. What, what is the word I'm looking for? Man, I cannot think today. I just had a bad past couple of days and like, my brain's all out of whack and I'm like lacking on sleep and I'm just like, ah! I needed like a vacation, but it's like too cold, but I really need a vacation somewhere. I just need to go somewhere for a couple of days and disappear from the world, take my phone off. I mean, I'll keep my phone for like YouTube and stuff, but just like not use my phone for a few days and on Facebook, you know. Facebook's really, really addictive. Look, there's a white castle. I'm sure I, I, if anyone even fucking watches these videos. Um, uh, Harold and Kumar, me and my buddy Mason were actually just talking about that when I took a break and stopped in his car for a minute. Never really liked that movie very much. I thought Guantanamo Bay was pretty good, but like, eh. I know, I wasn't a fan of White Castle. Those movies kind of get cheesy in my opinion. Like, I heard, like... The newest one they came out with, some baby like snorts cocaine and starts crawling all over the ceiling. It's like, eh, you know, that might be funny, but like that's going a little too far, you know? Like, even if a baby did snort cocaine, you know the nigga ain't gonna be fucking climbing on ceilings. He's just gonna be like, honestly, he's probably gonna be dead, really. They shouldn't have even pulled that joke. Like, man, it's kinda dark. Well, I mean, I can't really say much. I'm pretty messed up myself. I'm a really big fan of the human centipede movies. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, they're so good. They're so insane. Like, I, I don't know. I just, like, some things just, like, are so insane and unrealistic that, like, I just I just have to enjoy them because it's just fantastic. I don't know. It's just awesome. Really, really messed up stuff. Like, a while back, there was this kid. Apparently, according to multiple news reports, this kid got killed by a goat that fell from some, like, 20-story building or whatever. But it was a sacrificial goat. And it was fucking awesome. Oh my god, dude. Like, the goat just dropped out of there. It hit the kid. It killed him. And that's... Like, that man, that's sad. But that's fucking hilarious, dude. A fucking sacrificial goat. Like, who the fuck? That's awesome. <laughs> Not that I'm gonna sacrifice a goat, but if somebody else is doing that, that's fucking crazy. <laughs> I enjoy really crazy things. That or the one fucking kid. There is some guy in Pennsylvania. This just happened, like, last month. I don't even know. He, like, killed his mom... And had sex with her after she after he killed her. And the best part, uh, part of the interview was at some point he just stopped and was like, well, I guess I lost my virginity to a corpse. And he just gave this big smile and I'm like, this guy has balls of fucking titanium. I don't even know, man. That's crazy. I mean, like, I'm not going to fuck my dead mom. I'm not going to fuck dead people. But, like... And the concept of that is fascinating. Like necrophiliaism, cannibalism, you know, things that just like people freak the fuck out over and are so taboo. And like, honestly, yeah, it is pretty messed up. Uh, but it's also really, really interesting, you know, to learn about that different kind of stuff and why somebody has the need to have sex with a dead body. They might as well just get a fucking doll, honestly. Like, just get one of those blow up dolls or one of those, like, real life dolls that they make. I've seen those before. They're crazy. They use real human hair. And they're like so goddamn lifelike that pretty much if you were tripping balls on acid, that thing would probably be very, very, very real. Like, I don't know. Those things are crazy realistic. I've seen them and they're just like wacky. I don't even know. They're awesome. A Greenwich. Isn't, I think Greenwich is like a place. I feel like Greenwich is a place over in the UK. I don't know. 
man, I'm t I keep taking too many long videos. Like these five minute videos. I don't know, I enjoy talking and using words. I like this. I might be taking five minute videos every day. Every day, nigga. By the way, I can say nigga, I don't give a shit. To quote, to quote, um, it was a remix of a gorilla song, but to quote, out of that song of Clint Eastwood, the Five Life Cypher remix, I could never be a racist because I possess so many faces. And that has been the most true thing that I've ever heard in my life. I, I well, yeah, it's like out there, it's one of the most truest things I've ever heard in my life. I don't even know if most truest, right? I, fuck it, I don't even give a shit right now. Fuck it, fuck grammar! But yeah. I couldn't, you know? I, I just, I, I've been around so much. I've lived in the city, I've lived in the country, I've been friends with black people, white people, Asian people. I mean, I myself have gone through so many different motions and so many different aspects of my own human being. This girl's like geeking out, checking me out. Yo, what's up, baby? Yo, what's up, baby? Oh, she is like staring at me. Yo, you want my number? I mean, I know I live, you live in Jersey and I live in PA, but like, girl, girl. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Girl! Ah! Alright, I should really go.